Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports. We've got some NBA action for you coming up. With Brent Barry and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan, and Dave Aldridge will be joining us on the sideline as well. We've got the Los Angeles Lakers taking on the Boston Celtics. It'll be Los Angeles off the tip. And now the Lakers starting group. Abdul Jabbar is out with Bryant. Then it's O'Neal. Then it's Magic Johnson, and it's West in at the shooting guard. Now here's Bryant, and here's Johnson outside. Kuzi with the rebound. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the threes. To the paint, here's Russell, and the slam dunk by Russell. And that's his strongest trait, the, the unselfishness from Kuzi fantastic at realizing when one of his guys has an opportunity for a clean look to the inside Abdul Jabbar with the block and stolen by Russell here Kuzi guarded by Kobe Kuzi passes to Pierce and here's Bird for three and he's good on the three ball just such great consistency on that jump shot. Even though he's not always squared up, Bird terrific in the catch and shoot game. Now here's Kobe. On the wing, Kobe. Here's Boston now. Havlicek with it. Rest picks him up, and it goes down two points. Uncovered at the rim, finding cracks in the defense here early on just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad a shot's good from Abdul Jabbar and the lids off uh, they're one for four to begin this one but that shot might just get them going O'Neal comes with the guilty three pointer bird and again Boston with the triple shooting four or five to start the game that's got to be a feel good and so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Eight-point game. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. A shot by Bryant, no good. To the middle, here's Bird. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Bird's got eight. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. Well, if there were four or five boxes to check in terms of the game plan tonight, they might have checked six. I mean, doing everything out there. And here in the first, approaching three minutes played. Here's Kuzi. Bird outside. And it's sent back by O'Neal. And the aggressiveness on display here from O'Neal. Terrific at turning shots away with that size and length. Outstanding pass in transition there for the easy deuce. Austin leading by six. Outside Pierce. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. Just five to shoot. Here's Kuzi. Good. That's Russell picking up the assist. I tell you, Kuzi is pretty crafty down there on the block. Has that sense of how to score in traffic. Johnson for three. No good that time. And the Celtics going the other one now. We're getting cold in here. This is, this is a tough one. Crucial that he starts to work a little harder for a higher percentage shot. Russell passes to Pierce. Put on the bucket. 
excellent all-around performance so far. Hence the big lead. Well, if I was baking up a lead, I'd add two ingredients. One would be playing smart. The other one, playing selfless. They've done that tonight. Serve it up. The Celtics shooting their first free throw of the game here. And it's a completely new group for Los Angeles. What's up? James, he'll bring it up for Los Angeles. They trail by 11. Pass to Wilkes. And it's Cowens with the rebound. Well, they shouldn't be giving that shot to anyone, but they certainly shouldn't be giving it to him. That's a big break for the defense. Allen passes to McHale. Pierce finds Allen, and it's Rondo in the corner. And the rejection by LeBron. LeBron using his length that time perfectly. When he's in the area, you can't throw up anything lazy. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Such a critical part of how their offense is going to flow. Things are only working when he seems to be on the floor. Pass to McHale. Tries from 10. Boston again missing. Lakers trail by nine. Here's Goodrich. James trying to free himself up. They get it again. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again. And read the plate perfectly. Gets himself in the air at the right moment. Terrific denial. And the Celtics making a change here. Jones has checked in. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Pau Gasol has checked in for Chamberlain. Here's Cowens, defended by Gasol. Rondo scanning the floor. Here's McHale. He clangs that one off the back iron and down it falls. Orchestrating right now, Rondo should be playing with the baton. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Baylor's shot is off. Austin leading by 11. Over in the corner, Allen. And again, bust with the triple. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Here's LeBron. Here's Gasol. Foul in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. Well, the soul grinding out that rebound. If he's in there, his long arms are going to stretch out and snatch up that ball. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. Free throw drops for Gasol. Just four seconds left in the first. With one on the clock. That shot off. And so it's Boston. Holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. A look at the field goal percentage numbers tells the story of what tough defense they're playing today. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And a very convincing performance from the Celtics so far. Well, the coaches preach ball movement, and, and we saw exactly why in that first quarter. Well, everybody just feeling the energy of the basketball as they moved it around, and lots of hands were touching it. We've got Garnett. Jones is out there with White. Then it's Parrish, and it's Allen in at the three. The small forward. That's the five to begin the second quarter for the Celtics. And how about Allen, able to control his body on these physical finishes, terrific at keeping the balance as he's getting bumped by the defense. Now here's Gasol, passes it to Wilkes, and it's off from three-point range. 
Jones drives him, and Jones sends it in. Not the kind of aggressive defense they need to cut into the lead. Yeah, you have to protect the rim, Bragg, a little better. Good job to recognize the opportunity. That's just very solid offense. And way to finish and cut into that lead a little bit. Yeah, but look at the, ba the basket, guys, still shaking. Austin leading by 13. Jones, the best, Garnett. And here's Los Angeles now. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Alder. Kevin, thank you. Now we have seen continued growth with the NBA's affiliated leagues the last few years. Think about the explosion in popularity of the WNBA, the Basketball Africa League, expansion of the 2K League, greater pay in the WNBA and the G League pathway, along with the unionization of G League players. The league continues to show its commitment to expanding opportunities on multiple levels. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. Uh, when a pick like that is questionable, it creates that much of an advantage for the offense. You have to blow the whistle. Yeah, a quick little lean like that is going to get the ref's attention. Foul call. And the Lakers making a change here. Abdul Jabbar has checked in. And here's Bryant for three. And again, no good by the Lakers. Here's Bird, and it's good off the back rim and in. Bird's got 10 points a game. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Back to O'Neal. Good on the shot. O'Neal's got his first two points of the night. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Havlicek, the best to Kuzi. Down low, Russell, and the slam dunk by Russell. And the relentless nature that is Bill Russell. Always working for the best scoring opportunity. Won't find one better than that. Now here's Bryant. Let's it go with the three. Los Angeles keeps it going. A new 14-second shot clock. And O'Neal gets it to go. Yeah, and O'Neal just a brute on the block simply overpowers the opposition time out, time out. and now the first time out called here for Boston Paul Pierce has checked in for Kevin Garnett. Magic Johnson, who checked in for the Lakers. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Here's Kuzi. Johnson with the clock. They recover it. Five on the clock. Here's Havlicek. And from the top of the key, he buries it. Havlicek's got his second basket of the night. Another good play. This is how they built the lead, calling on the right guys at the right time. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Now here's West. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And here's Bryant for three. Rebound, Boston. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And this feels like it snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. That's it, and the Celtic lead is cut down now to just 10 on the basket from Jerry West. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Johnson. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. Oh, Russell in position. Throws down the alley-oop slam. And remember, Havlicek was a highly recruited quarterback, so you see his passing ability on that one. West outside, fires from deep. And Boston with the rebound. Russell's got his fifth rebound right now in game. 
Kuzi passes to Russell. Applejack outside. Here's against Bryant. Here, Kuzi. That one good for two. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. Got to fight over it as a defender. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. And, and you look at all things this man brings to the game. The focus, the resolve, the winner's mindset. I mean, there's a reason why they call him the logo. Some changes for the Lakers. Chamberlain's checked in for Shaq. LeBron comes in for Abdul-Jabbar. And it's Baylor in for Kobe. Now here's Rondo. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Cowens passes to Rondo. And James picks up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Jones checked in for Boston. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Goodrich is checked in. Johnson against Rondo. The pass to Cowens. It's stolen by Johnson. Here's Goodrich. That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's one for two. And the insane peripheral vision there. If anyone's open, even for an instant, Magic's gonna find you. There's 45 seconds left to play here in the half. A shot by Rondo is no good. Lakers trail by 11. Here's Justin. Good, and the assist goes to James. Well, how about LeBron reading the defense, waiting and being patient there until the gap opened up to deliver? Rondo passes to McHale. No good that time, so Los Angeles will take the other way. Here's Johnson, and he makes good on the layup. Johnson's got four points in the quarter. And their shots are falling now with more regularity than we saw at first. You take your time. You don't give them another possession. Yeah, hopefully that's what they'll do here. It's what most teams try to execute at this time in the game. Here's Rondo, and he uses the glass on the way up. But right now, Rondo just cutting through there with, with not much effort, and the speed took over. Three seconds left. That's in, and the Celtic lead is cut down now to just seven on the buck from Johnson. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. And so that brings the first half to a close. It's the Celtics up by seven. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Without question, Larry Bird displaying his skills today. Yeah, and through the first two quarters, he has been the offense for this team. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. And for those of you just tuning in, thanks for being with us. The second half of this game still to play. So the Lakers five right now. Abdul Jabbar is out there with O'Neal. Then there's West, and there's Bryant, and it's Johnson in at the point guard. Now here's Bird. Fires the three. Score the bucket. He's made five so far, shooting very clean, five of seven. Could there be any doubt? I mean, Bird's such a dead-eye shooter. Sometimes this guy practices threes with his eyes closed. Here's Johnson. Offensive rebound. Pass to Bryant from past the arc. And the Lakers get it back. Here's Abdul's bar. Tough sequence there. They just couldn't get it to fall. You talk about things at halftime, and then you come out and you go 0 for 3. I'm sure that wasn't up on the board. And a little luck that time, but it drops. And it's a 12-point Boston lead. His shooting has been outstanding. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. West misses. Not sure they realize it's not halftime anymore for attempts. And they're still looking for their first buck. Johnson over to help. 
And there's the feed to Havlicek. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Yeah, and among the many things to like about Hondo, he is strictly about the team. Willing to take on any role, he just wants to win. Oh, Fritos, good from Havlicek. And that's the norm for him. He's pretty much automatic when he's at the line. Get there, get there. West inside, covered by Havlicek. Pass to Abdul-Jabbar. Shoots over Bird. Abdul-Jabbar can't get it to go. Ouch. Five shots without a mate. That's a really ragged start coming out of halftime. Yes, that goes in. Boy, you have to be impressed with the offensive production. They have got it firing on all cylinders. I mean, this team is just dangerous. Right now, every shot that they're putting up feels like it's going in. Offensive rebound. O'Neal. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. It's going to be on Bill Russell. Oh, the officials are all over that one. It's his first trip to the line. O'Neal hits them both. And we're just about two minutes of the second half now. Havlicek outside. Outside, Pierce. Shoots over Worthy. The shot by Pierce will not go. Lakers trail by 14. Passes to O'Neal. And stolen by Russell. Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. Oh, and the jam by Russell. Here he comes, and there he goes. Oh, look at him punish that rim. And so it's West with it. He brings it up for Los Angeles. And the pass to Abdul-Jabbar. Here's O'Neal. Nice concentration to hit the double clutch layup. Shaq's got four points this quarter. Yeah, it takes a lot to knock O'Neal off balance. A massive player who just did off the D with ease. It's a hand on it. Worthy pulls it in. And here's Los Angeles. It's a 14-point game. Wilkes, good. He's been accurate tonight. I think the best way for them to succeed is to get him more shots. Sounds simple, but it comes down to execution. Here's Kuzi. Here's the pass to Havlicek. The shot from the low post is good. Havlicek's got 10 points. And Matador defense, that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now, just gift-wrapping points. And the Lakers decide to take their first time out here. And Los Angeles will go for a different look here. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. Here's Baylor. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. And, you know, beyond all the things Baylor gives you, he's an entertainer out on the floor. The acrobatics we see, something spectacular from this guy almost every game. And so Baylor nails both of them. This is as good as it gets from the cherry strike here in the second. And what kicks to Bird. Inside. Now contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Well, Celtics shooting their fourth attempt at the free throw line right here. Yeah, and in every generation or so, a player comes along who can be considered a true superstar. Folks, that's Larry Bird. Here's Wilkes. Los Angeles with another miss. Celtics leading by 15. Here's Havlicek. Here's Bird. A good finish at the rack off the slick feed. Bird's got 20. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring a foul. Oh! Ouch. And I gotta say, sort of surprising he goes for a slam that difficult when they're Like that in stride, beautiful assist. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively 
for sure. On the wing, Burke. And again, Boston with triple. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Here's Wilkes. And as we conclude the third quarter, pretty much a blowout. It's in a one-sided affair. It's the Celtics opening up a huge gap. And after a quick break, we're going to come right back with the start of the fourth quarter. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. Now Johnson. Allen is out there with Kevin McHale, and it's Rajon Rondo, then it's Jones, and it's Garnett in at the five. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Here's McHale, lays it up and banks it in. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Kobe, that's for two. Rebound, Boston. And it's another just bad decision on a night full of those. His shot selection tonight has been questionable at best. Johnson with the puck. The drive by Bryant, and Bryant slams it in. And Bryant just a superb athlete, terrific at just imposing his will on the defense on that drive. This has been a one-sided affair. Yeah, they've done a nice job of extending their lead and maintaining that intensity level. Here's Rondo. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Yeah, no stopping him on that play. Sometimes even the taller defenders are helpless to stop him. Yeah, and if you're going to give Brian a lane to the rim, then you deserve to get dunked on. You know how tenacious he is when penetrating inside. And it's Rondo with the ball for Boston. Jones drives him, and he gets it to go. Now that's the kind of passing right there that makes a difference, not just in that position, but maybe on your play for the entire game. That one falls. Bryant's got six in the quarter. Just about one and a half minutes gone by here in the fourth. Jones, the pass to Garnett. Back to Jones. Chamberlain with the block. And the quickness off the floor, the insane reach. Well, one of the greatest shot blockers you'll ever see. The three from Bryant. And Boston with the rebound. And the shots just continue to say no in terms of falling. And it's Rondo in the corner. Back to Jones. Knocked away. It's stolen by Bryant. And Kobe throws it down. And Bryant has always gotten credit for being a fierce defender, clogging and digging, jumping on those steals when they present themselves. Jones looking for an opening. Got a piece of it. And now Bryant pushing it up. No one back to stop him. And Kobe throws it down. Excellent on both ends of that play. Yeah, the steal was sharp, but the slam topped it off. And we say it time and time again, so I'll repeat it. Have to be careful with the ball, or this is what happens. Time on time the basket by Jones. When a player gets a feel for that floater, it can really make things tough on defenders. You're just not sure how to guard them and where your point of commitment is. Some judges for the Lakers. O'Neal's back in for Chamberlain. Abdul-Jabbar comes in for Pau Gasol. And West subs in for James. Here's Kobe. That's good, and it's Johnson with the assist. Johnson's got five assists in the game. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. Kuzi pass to Russell. Feeds it to Hamilton. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. 
It's going to go on Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. The first one falls. The Celtics making a switch here. Burst checked in. Oh, free throw. Good from Havlicek. A bit under three and a half minutes of pass during the fourth. Here's Johnson. That one doesn't drop. Now Boston takes it the other way. Now here's Pierce. And here's Russell. Outside Pierce. Back to Russell. Here's Bird. Lays it up off the glass. Bird's got 27 points. He takes care of salvaging that possession for the offense by getting on the offensive glass. A three from Bryant. Rebound Boston. Russell's got rebound number eight now on the night. Applejack outside. Pierce against Kobe. And Kobe Bryant gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. Yeah, clearly a foul of frustration right there. And that was another look at the aggressive D that led to the mobile one block. And that'll give him a jolt. Nothing like a rejection to light a fire on him. 143 left in the fourth quarter. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. That's good from O'Neal. That one is no good. Not a perfect trip to the free throw line, but they'll take what they can get at this point. Outside, White. Pass to Cowan. And here is Parrish. Abdul Jabbar covering. Shot clock at six. Fires. High post. Count that one. Havlicek's got ten points here in the second half. And guys, you got to know who you're guarding. You, you got to run the shooter off that sweet spot. And for Havlicek, that's anything in mid-range area. Really, really good at recognizing the gaps and getting the ball to the rim. Boston lead by 23. Jones with it. It's White on the wing. He kicks it to Jones. No good from outside. Bryant, that's for two. And it doesn't even draw out. 41 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. First one falls for him. And one for two. And so he hits both. Here's Johnson. We've got 33 seconds left play here in the fourth. No good from Baylor. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. White dishes to Parrish. Back to White. 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Collins. And that one barely misses as he draws contact. Two free throws coming up. And how about that skill set that Cowens possesses? Shoots a high clip from the field and rebounds the ball well at either big man position. He's perfect from the line this time. 11 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Baylor. Here's Worthy. And the layup falls. Such a big part of what he does for this team. Just work and work on the boards. Generate second chance opportunities. And hopefully convert. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. They poured it out and a dominant showing in front of a crowd that loved every minute of it. And you know, this game could really be a defining one for what they can do when they...